Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to a snowy desert! Today we are back in hardcore career mode in Stormworks, and uh, we're actually at the hospital because we ended up dropping off four guys, I believe, out of five uh, that we rescued last time, and uh, our plane that we used last time is actually out there, flipped over in the water. So, today, what I think we're gonna do is actually fly from here, which is where we are right now, uh, over to uh, this place right here, the gas station, modify this plane a little bit so it'll float a little bit better, and then we're gonna try and rescue our other plane. Don't... I don't know how this is gonna go. I really don't know how this is gonna go, but we're gonna go ahead and try it anyway. So, let's go ahead and get inside this thing. We'll take off, we'll fly to the gas station, we'll land, and then we'll take off again, we'll fly down to there, and we'll try and pull it back to here. That's where we need to get it to. No idea how this is going to go. Anyway, let's do this. Alright, so we're inside the plane. Let's go ahead and do this. There we go. Awesome. And press 3 for brakes. And take off. Okay. Okay, that was a bit weird. <laughs> but we are in the sky, so there we go. Good. Um, did I actually put the waypoint in the right place? I, I think I did, but I don't know. Anyway, let's go ahead and set this. There we go. Uh, we also can actually lower this a little bit, uh, down to like 0.75-ish, there we go, and that's fine. So we did actually set the waypoint, that's good, we'll fly over there, and we'll land. Okay, uh, this might be a more tricky landing than I thought, because I can't see anything. Um, once we do land, I am gonna go to sleep, just so that, uh, we do obviously, um, have vision tomorrow. <laughs> um, cause yeah, sometimes... Sometimes we don't really have vision when we land, uh, and sometimes, you know, actually, I don't even think this thing has lights. Um, that is a good point. Anyway, let's return this, and I guess we should give it some lights. But the first thing that I want to do is actually grab one of these, and shove it on the back. This is where we're going to be pulling it from, uh, because I believe that is going to be our uh, nicest point to pull it from, I guess? I don't know. Um, maybe. Not sure. Anyway, um, the other thing that I wanted to do as well is actually add maybe a winch with my goals on it so that we can pull it that way. Uh, don't know if that's going to work out though, so we'll see. But anyway, um, lights. Yes, let's add lights. Alright, cool. So we've done that. Let's go ahead and get ourselves a winch real quick. Uh, we will actually attach this to here. It's only going to be a relatively small one, which, you know, I think it's fine. Actually, should we attach it somewhere up? Mm, I don't want it to be that low, really, is what I'm thinking. Maybe we do actually attach it to here. Um, which may or may not be a really ugly location, but that's fine. Um, we're then going to put our buttons in here. Here we go, toggle buttons, one, two, and three. Uh, let's attach these guys to here. So there's one, there's two, and there's three. Excellent. We now need to add a an actual thing. So, hold on. We need a pivot. Really quickly. There we go. Awesome. Go ahead and shove that onto there. We then need an anchor. There it is. Nice. Cable anchor. Let's go and shove that onto there. And then we need a magol. So, I'm not sure if one magol is going to be able to do this, or we need multiple. So, we're actually going to go with three. There we go. So, each of those is going to be turned on by this one. There we go. Uh, and that should be it. At least I think so, anyway. So connect those guys together, connect all of that, there we go, good. Connect these guys, and then from there, we can connect it to there. Alright, cool. Let's just make sure this works really quickly. I need a new torch too, that's a good point. Uh, we haven't actually connected these guys together, so let's do that as well. One second. Uh, rope, yes, connect that guy right to there, that is awesome. We're also going to get ourselves a hose, just in case we actually need to use that thing up there as well. Because if we do, uh, it'd be useful to actually have something to attach it to. Alright, good. Um, yeah, alright, cool. We also need a flashlight, so let's do that as well. Flashlight, yes. Um, I guess I'm just going to go and shove that in there. Probably. There we go, good. I'm going to run around the other side. I'm going to drop this one on the floor and pick that one up. There we go. Alright, cool. So, this is our current vehicle. Go ahead and press this button. They have turned on. That goes down. This comes up. That's all we need. Okay, very good. Very good indeed, eh? I'm gonna push that sideways. I'm gonna do this. And then I'm gonna swing this into here. Maybe. No? Hold on, not that one. I want the middle one on. Why can't I... Oh, because that massive thing is in the way. Alright, hold on. 
I can't actually attach that on to the actual vehicle. I'm thinking it's just going to swing around otherwise. That's why I'm trying to attach it, but never mind. All right, cool. Let's go and turn this off and go to sleep. And then once we wake up in the morning, we're going to go try and rescue our own plane. This is a really bad idea, and I do feel like it's going to go wrong. But we got to try it. Oh, guess what I did? I slept with the torch on again. That's so dumb that that's a thing. All right, let's drop that on the ground. There we go. Run over to this side, grab a new one, and there we go. That's good. We're also going to restock this and this and this. There we go. And we are ready to go. I'm going to drop the defibrillator too. Okay. So, let's select this as a destination. There we go. It's very close to the island now, but that's fine. Go and press 1. Throttle up to 75-ish. There we go. And take off. We can't see a single thing, but I'm sure that's fine. Come on. Get in the air. Thank you. Maybe I should have made this thing stronger before doing this, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, I believe we are over the water. Yes, we are. Um, it is extremely hard to see where the water even starts and ends. I, I don't know where anything is. Um, so this is tricky, but I think we got this. Even if we have to tow this thing like a boat, I think we'll be good. All right, here we go. Let's fly down. I can just about see the water here, so that's good. I don't want to crash into the fort. That is another thing that we need to watch out for. But, um... Oh, it's wavy as. It is so wavy. There it is. Uh-oh. 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 No, 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 no. Dodge the fort. Dodge the fort. Whew! Okay, right. We landed, but we are going to take off again. At least sort of. I, I don't mind if we just turn. That would be fine, too. Wait. Are we really not strong enough to take off like this? We must be. There we go. Alright, cool. Good. Oh, no! What just happened? Uh-oh. Alright, luckily... It is writing itself. So we have a plane that does write itself. That's good. <laughs> um, but that wasn't amazing, that. That was not amazing. Alright, hold on. Let's fly forwards. And so we get to our aircraft that is downed in the water. We are not powerful enough with this plane. We won't be. Unless we are. But I don't think we are. This is going to be tricky. Alright, cool. So it is still upside down. That's fine. Uh, one of the things that I wouldn't mind doing is just trying to flip it over first. Before we do anything else. So I'm going to just sort of get past it. Uh, like this. There we go. I'm going to turn this off for now. There we go. Alright, and... I mean, I don't have any rope anchors on this thing. I, I should have actually added them to this one as well. Just in case this one goes down in this rescue attempt. Which, you know, is somewhat likely. Uh, so let's go ahead and drop that down. Turn it on. Grab this. We are quite far away. I'm, I'm assuming we are going to be able to get over there, though. I'm dying. Okay, that was... Lucky that I found that, but sure. Why is it... Why are we warm? Is something on fire? <laughs> it says that we're warm in the bottom right. Like there's a heat source nearby. I don't think there is. Alright, I'm going to continue swimming. We're going to try our best to get all the way out there. And we're going to attach onto the, uh, that little bit right there on the front. Hopefully we have enough winch here. I think we will. But I don't know. And then I guess we're just going to try and pull it. I was going to try and tip it over first before trying this. But I don't know whether that's a good idea or not. I don't know. I, I don't know what to do here. I'm sure everything will be fine. Alright, so we're almost there. Um, Very close. Very close indeedy. There we go. We've attached on right to the center. Unfortunately, the bottom one doesn't seem to want to attach on, but that's okay. Right, good. So, we have that sorted. We are attached on to... Our other plane. It is decided that it wants to sink because of that. There is a shark! Woo! There's a shark! Okay, right. Uh, the shark is actually attacking our plane. I didn't think that's what the sharks did. How many sharks are there? There's one there. Is there just one? There's two sharks. Why is there sharks? You rarely ever sh sh see sharks in this game now. Um, right, okay. Well, I think this is the... Uh, the bit where we say goodbye to this plane as well. I, I think. Look at them! Look at those sharks! Alright, okay. Uh, yeah, we're ready to go, aren't we? So, 
Uh, I think because we're using my goals, we actually need to go somewhat slowly. So let's go ahead and try that real quick. Here we go. We're going to go as slow as we can until we get tension. Once we have tension, we could go a little bit faster. At least I think, anyway. Here we go. And take off. No, it has disconnected already and literally connected straight back onto us. That's ridiculous. So I guess we're going to... Whoa. We're legit going to have to use the hose that I did attach. Just in case this was going to be an issue. So... Let's lift ourselves into the sky, because it's easier to turn around in the air. I say that. I don't know. I don't know if we're quite powerful enough for this, you know. I don't know if we are. Alright, I'm trying to turn around. It's quite windy. Alright, slowly but surely we are... We are managing to turn around. Turn again. There we go. Alright, cool. And turn ag ag again. Yeah, alright, we are managing to sort of drive this, this is good. So, we're going to connect on to the hose connector part. And we're going to hope that we can actually tip this thing over. With the angle that we're going in for this, I think we might be able to do that. But we'll have to see, so... We're dri Whoa! We're driving in. I want to stay relatively close, so let's go ahead and turn it off here. There we go, good. I'm going to jump out. Grab the hose. There it is. Attach it to there. Swim across. Attach it to the back end. And we'll be good. I do need to keep an eye out for sharks. Because they're menacing. Okay? They are menacing. There we go. Attach that onto there. And let's go. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, floor it, I guess. Alright, so there you go. 77. Go, go, go. Alright, let's see what happens here. I'm going to go sideways. We are pulling. And the plane is just sort of coming with us. I don't know whether we can somewhat turn this over like this. Looks like it might be tipping now. Alright, and... Yes! Alright, no, that is actually tipped it over. Fantastic! Good! Alright, we're both still facing somewhat the same direction too, which is good. We are gonna jump out of here. Okay, good. We are gonna disconnect this guy. Shove it into there, good. Get our thingy bobby back. We're gonna turn this off. And we're gonna grab this. And we're gonna shove it in the cargo area of this plane. Okay, so just like this. I want it to be very much central. There we go. Gonna attach it. Oh, that didn't work. Nope, pretty much to... No. Come on. Have it flat. I need it to be flat, otherwise we're gonna have issues, you know? Alright, that, that sort of works. Alright, cool. We're going to go ahead and turn it on there. I need to watch out for sharks still, because I think they're still in... The, yeah, they're still in the area. Uh, and we're going to just take off. I think the gyro on that plane is still on. I believe so. Let's go ahead and press 1. Throttle it up. And go. Slowly does it. I say slowly, does it? We are now full throttle. It's disconnecting and reconnecting quite a lot. And we are pulling as hard as we can right now. There's no way I can get this into the air, is there? There's no way. I was trying my best there, but there's, there's nothing I can do there. Unless we attach it together now. So, let's winch in a lot. There we go. Have it connect together. Where we are, so we are currently, like, attached together, essentially. It might do better this way, because then it might sort of see us as one sort of vehicle, I guess. Uh, and try and take off that way. I don't know, but it is getting very close to being done. There we go, so disconnect this now. Alright, good. And let's go again. I can't take off. Yeah, we are nowhere near strong enough to actually use this to take off with. However, we are able to tow it pretty much back. So, let's go ahead and tow it to the coast. Somewhere over here. And then once we've got it to the coast... We can use a different vehicle to maybe get it back. 
Or, actually, side note, we can just leave this one that we've got right here bobbing in the ocean, because this one's relatively stable. And then the other one that we've got behind us, we can fly that back. Which might make sense. Yeah, you know what? That probably does make sense. Maybe. Okay, I have um, I have actually got a really dumb idea. I want to try it, though. So, uh, I'm going to turn on the engine in the back one. <laughs> and we're going to try and make that actually fly by itself. Whilst also allowing this one to fly. I don't know how that's going to go, but let's try it. Okay, so let's get in. There we go. Press 1. Throttle it up. There we go. Engage the, uh, the pushers. To, like... 50? Oh, yeah, that didn't work. That didn't work. That was a bad idea. That was... That was a severe... That was a really, really, really bad idea. I thought that we were actually a little bit further back than we were. And that we weren't going to push underneath it. But, yeah, that was a dumb idea. Now it doesn't have any propellers. But you know what? I'm expecting that we should leave this one just sitting in the ocean, to be honest. And we should fly the other one home. So, I'm of that opinion because this one hopefully won't flip over. Um, or should we just try and keep going forwards until we get to the coast? I feel like that does make sense too. Let's do that. So, we're going to th throttle this up again. And we're going to keep going until we get to the coast. Come on. Turning is extremely difficult with this on the back. But that's okay. I think we're still going in somewhat the right direction. And we'll be there soon. Alright, so we are almost there, as you guys can see. And I do think I am going to try and drag it onto the land. Uh, just so that then we can slap on the brakes. And uh, I think it'll be a lot, I don't know, safer up there if we do it that way. So we're going to continuously drive. I don't know whether this is a cliff. It looks like it might be. Oh god. Okay, right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and pitch up so that I actually angle myself to drive up this cliff. Okie dokie. And I have driven up said cliff. And we are dragging our friend up the cliff. Hey, would you look at that? Nicely done, everybody. Alright, we're going to go a little bit further up. And I think I'm going to leave it over here somewhere. So let's go ahead and turn it sideways. There we go. Let's go ahead and turn on the brakes. Um, number three. There we go. Excellent. And then we'll jump out. We'll turn on the other brakes on the other vehicle. And... I think we've actually done an excellent job today. Would you look at that? Who would have thought that today we would actually rescue our plane from the ocean? Not me. Honestly, not me. But we did it. We actually did it. Alright, so uh, what I'm going to do now is actually repair this one. Here we go, just the propellers. If I can. I don't want to die when I repair these, so hopefully we don't. Um, but yeah, we've made it out of the water and we've put them on land. Uh, the main thing now is that we can actually just leave this here. We can fly back home, and then we'll be able to come back out here with, like, a car or something. Uh, and then we'll be able to just fly this home as well, and then we'll be able to run back out and grab the car. Uh, or something along those lines. Or, I might actually be able to come up with a new design, uh, where we'd be able to just maybe have my goals located right here and right there. Oh, right there and right there. Attach those goals directly onto this and this. And then hopefully take off as one vehicle after that. I don't know. Or maybe multiplayer. That would make sense too. But anyway, for now, I think I'm going to end this video here. Uh, there is a ship honking its horn at me. There it is. Uh, and I guess I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.